dream or possibility? You see, in the 1950s, everyone was talking about the future, the land of tomorrow. Everyone was predicting what they thought their future was gonna look like. So it raises the question, how did Point Claire see its future locally? Well, one artist saw its future like this. Here's an artist's rendering from 1956 of what they thought Point Claire could or should look like in 2006. So let me explain what you're looking at. It seems as though the yacht club is still there, the school is still there, the church is still there, the windmill is probably somewhere there. Actually, it's not there. And it seems as though they didn't think that we'd fill in that field behind the school. And all the houses that are just west of the golf course all seem to still be there. But the major difference of what actually didn't happen was the strip along Lakeshore Road. That, they imagined, was going to be one massive shopping mall. And what are these two massive hotels? That definitely didn't happen. What's interesting about this picture is that this artist thought that downtown Point Claire would be in the current day Point Claire Village. But not too long after this, the city began to expand outside of the village, with City Hall being up on St. John's and Lakeside Heights and high schools and more residentials, and then eventually with Fairview, way up further north above the tracks. And what happened to Point Claire Village? Well, alas, it stayed a village. Whether that's a good thing or a bad thing is not for me to say in this video. The point of this video is to celebrate a moment in time when development seemed infinite.